At Oticon, we have a very specific mission, and that's to create a better future for every child with hearing loss. You've allowed us to partner with you to create that better future for every child, and we recognize our responsibility in that partnership. That responsibility includes creating very excellent signal processing technologies in order to mitigate the effects of hearing loss. These technologies need to be adaptable for the individual nature of each child's life, and further, they need to reflect the practicalities of living with hearing loss. One of the important practicalities that we recognize with hearing loss is that hearing loss is a fundamental change in the way speech information is provided to the child. The child has to learn speech and language through this disordered system. The goal of amplification is to provide the very best information to that child's developing system. Speech understanding at the heart of the matter is a cognitive process. It happens in the brain. And the brain looks for certain information. Our goal is to be able to create signal processing approaches for, for children that provide the brain with the very best signal possible in order to have the greatest capability of developing speech and language to the highest degree possible. Throughout the course of the day, the child with normal hearing has access to a broad range of speech sounds in the environment. The goal when fitting amplification is to replicate this full range of audibility for the child with hearing loss. The researchers at University of Western Ontario and other research groups around the world have shown us the value of being able to replicate full audibility for the child with hearing loss. Over the recent years, though, we've recognized that you can create this audibility in different ways, and some ways are better than others in terms of preserving the full information in the speech signal. With SpeechGuard E, we've created a nonlinear amplification approach that allows us to meet the requirements of DSL, but to do it in a way that fully protects the speech information that's so vital for the child to develop full speech and language capabilities. A natural characteristic of the speech signal is that each and every phoneme has its own natural level. In fact, the range of levels from the most intense vowels to the softest consonants is about 30 dB. So in the ongoing speech waveform, the vowels will come in and have very high peak levels compared to some of the softer unvoiced consonants. These natural differences between level, between the vowels and the consonants and within the consonants, carry information to help the listener identify what the speech signal actually is. Therefore, when you create a, an amplification system, one of the sources of information that you're trying to protect are the natural differences from phoneme to phoneme. If we take a look at the way a tr traditional fast-acting compression system is going to work, it's going to take this natural 30 dB range of inputs and project it into the listener's ear canal, but over a much smaller range of outputs. That's the nature of fast-acting compression, that this natural 30 dB range of inputs is projected over a much smaller range of outputs. What ends up happening when you do that compression is that these natural level differences from phoneme to phoneme are lost within that compression process. That's a natural tendency with fast-acting compression. What we've created with SpeechGuard is an approach where we can take this natural 30 dB range of inputs and project it into the output range within the child's ear canal without losing that natural 30 dB range from the softest consonants to the most intense vowels. Therefore, with SpeechGuard, you can create full audibility, but at the same time, you can maintain these natural level differences from the more intense vowels to the softest consonants available in the speech signal. Being able to do that allows a full representation of the cue set in the speech signal to be projected into the child's brain. Importantly, because of the way speech guard works, if a loud intrusive sound comes in the environment, for example, if a dog barks or if a door slams or something very loud happens in the environment, the system will very quickly react and make sure that, si that signal does not become too loud for the listener, but then immediately go back to the gain parameter that allows full audibility of the signal, but without losing the full extent of the dynamic range. The combination of pre creating full audibility but protecting the full cue set is what we believe really sets SpeechGuard apart from more traditional compression systems in the marketplace. Pediatric audiologists like yourself recognize the importance of fitting children based on the DSL fitting properties. SpeechGuard E is fully compatible with the DSL approach. We recognize the value of full audibility. But what's unique about SpeechGuard E is that we believe we can create this audibility in a better way than traditional compression systems can. We believe that with SpeechGuard E, we're protecting vital speech information that's essential for the child to have access to if that child's going to develop speech and language capabilities to the fullest extent possible. 
Over the last couple of years, we've engaged some important research facilities around the world in testing out the SpeechGuard E approach with children. Those results have confirmed exactly what we expected, is that the SpeechGuard E approach does a better job than traditional fast-acting compression approaches at providing information that the child can use for understanding speech in complex listening environments. Together with you, we've partnered to try to create a better future for every child with hearing loss. We believe that SpeechGuard E is an excellent example of our commitment to creating the very best signal processing technologies to allow children to develop speech and language competencies to the highest level possible. It is a privilege to be able to work with you to do this important work, and together we do believe that we can create this better future for every child with hearing loss. Thank you.